Hi everyone, in this video we will see a simple spring into action when placed between car and bumper. Let's start, I'll open the assembly file. I'll first insert the barrier and road surface. Next, I'll insert the car model. I've extruded two bodies for bumper spring attachment. Just manually adjusting the car over the platform by dragging it. For now, I'll also mate the wheel with the platform, for proper placement. I'll also mate the rear wheel. The car is properly placed now. Now, I'll insert the bumper. I'll fix the car component for now, for mating the bumper. The entire assembly looks fine. Make the car component floating again, and suppress the mates of wheel with platform, since we will need the car moving for motion study. Let's go to motion study. Select the basic motion option. Change some settings for better motion. We will insert the linear spring now. Selecting the edges of car and bumper, as spring end points. The spring on screen is just display representation. Spring stiffness and free length are important parameters. We will change the stiffness to 100 Newton per mm. Similarly, we will add second spring. Changing the stiffness to 100 Newton per mm. Now we will add contact between bumper and barrier, and, car and platform. We will enable the gravity, but in car moving direction, to provide acceleration to the car. Change the value to 980 mm per second square. The other components are fixed and won't undergo acceleration. We will drag the final time key to 2 seconds. Click on Calculate. I'll reduce the playback speed. Let's check the video.
we observe that the spring doesn't have enough stiffness and the bumper spring back action is not seen. We will increase the spring stiffness. Make it 1000 Newton per mm for both springs. Again click on calculate. Let's check it again. We see some significant spring action between car and bumper. We will now increase the car acceleration, which is the gravity value. Make it 5000 mm per second square. Calculate again. Let's check the spring action closely. Let's see from another view. Stiffness, acceleration, and car model can be changed to check different results. Hope this video was interesting. Thank you. Subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for upcoming videos.